540 on this Wednesday morning, halfway through the work week. And Carson, we've been enjoying some nice temperatures so far. Really has. So we were in the 70s yesterday, and we didn't get out of the 20s last Tuesday, Isaac. But luckily, the warm weather is here, and it's here to stay for at least today. But changes are on the way. Let's talk about those changes. Longview Tower Cam, you can see the wind there in the background showing up with the flags. And that's because, well, we do have a strong southerly wind in place out of the south southwest, anywhere from 15 to 16 miles per hour from Tyler to Athens. And that will continue to be the case throughout the day until that front arrives. Temperatures in the 50s and 60s currently, with the exception of Center and Hemp Hill. It's 46 in Center, 53 in Lufkin, 53 in Nacogdoches. So today we do hit a high temperature in the middle 70s, mostly cloudy. Showers should remain off to the south of Interstate 20, so you may want to remember those umbrellas just in case. Tonight we do remain dry with a low around 48 degrees, but still going to be cloudy for us. What weather is on the way? We're starting to see some evidence of that in the higher elevations in the Pacific. Northwest that will be tracking to the east over the next 24 or so hours, leading to an increased chance of rain as we go into tomorrow night and Friday morning. So let's talk about that on future cast. First off, it's going to be a warm day by three o'clock. We got temps in the 70s. Front's going to roll through and that should actually provide some drier air for us, meaning the clouds are going to be pushed to deep east Texas. But that's what that rain chance I was talking about. That's where it's going to be there by three o'clock on the southern fringe of our viewing area. Now as we go into tonight, most of that precip stays to our south and to our east. Temperatures in the 40s and 50s by one o'clock in the morning heading into tomorrow morning and by noontime temperatures in the 50s. So a much cooler day is expected a few showers two hours south, but rain really gets going as we go into Thursday night and Friday morning. This is nine o'clock notice on long into the north of Interstate 20. That's where the main bulk of the precipitation is going to be. And if we continue to see model runs like this five o'clock Friday morning, we could be dealing with an inch or two of rain. So here's tomorrow night's forecast. Heaviest rain falls to the north and the darker green, lighter green. That means a light rain for your Friday morning forecast. We will see the heaviest rain off to our north and to our east with lighter totals occurring for parts of of deep east Texas, especially to the south of I-20. Here's that seven day forecast rain tomorrow night and Friday morning and then additional chances of rain Saturday, Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. High temperatures will be in the 60s and 70s and deep east Texas is going to follow suit. We're trending a little bit warmer, just about a 40% chance of rain Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. For the latest weather forecast, you can head on over to our website that is